Hey guys, uh, good morning. Today I'll be discussing about CSB Bank in a bit more detail. So generally, when I cover a, a a particular company, I do it after when I see a lot of scope in the business going forward. That means what? That means the business is in the mode of expanding its distribution. The business is in the mode of say doing a lot of capex, whether it's in digital or say opening more branches or you know expanding the channels, right? So. Thing is, thing is, ke this ke like you'll make a lot of money in the stock market when you can when you can gauge the outlook of a business in the next three, five, seven, ten years, right? So you don't want a business which is not doing any capex today, right? Even though it has done a lot a lot of thing in the past, because in the stock market you make a lot of money when say you look into the future, right? So I'm going to be covering one bank today. As I said, it's CSB Bank, right? CSB Bank is one of the few banks that I really like, and I believe that like they are doing the right things at the right time. Okay, so in a way, that like I'll cover the business model of CSB Bank, the financials, but the most important thing is that I'll talk about is the management outlook, right? That management bowl is coming, and further down in the next three, five, seven years, what can happen to the bank, right? So. If you believe, like, and today, if you see, CSB Bank is only a five thousand crore market cap bank, right? And they are going for a pan India expansion, right? And they are going for a lot of new things, which, of course, I, I'm going to be discussing here in this short video. But here is the thing, right? Okay, the focus is more on management outlook. The focus is more on, say, for example, what the company is doing, right? In terms of investments and in in terms of capex. So, of all the banks that I keep reading on every quarter-on-quarter -quarter basis, I believe that CSB Bank is 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 one of the banks that you can really track well. I mean, it's no stock recommendation, but you have to understand that like if a company is making a lot of investments and capex, that means usko dekhna chahiye aage jaake, right? And it's not about putting the money in, right? You can grow with this business. Again, a disclosure: like I don't own the bank yet, I don't own any stock of this bank, but I'm tracking this business uh, 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 like every quarter, and I may put an investment. Into this bank going forward. So let's 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 start understanding about CSB Bank. Okay. So I have my copy with me. So I have written all the all the all the notes here. First is understand this CSB Bank. Let's understand the business model. Okay. Business model in banking is more about knowing where is the bank lending. Okay. So CSB Bank is a Southern India based bank. And today, if you look at it today, 45, 46 percent of their loan book. So their total loan book is around 20,000 crore. Okay. And let's let's not go into numbers and all that. Let's understand. So. Out of the total loan book, forty-five percent of the loan book is gold loans, right? Now here is the thing, right? If your total loan book may forty-five, fifty percent are gold loans, right? Gold loans are very safe, right? Gold loans are safe in a way, like if let's say you give out gold loans, you have the collateral as gold, right? So gold loan businesses generally stay in business; they don't go out of business. But having also said that, you don't make big money with gold loans. So CSB Bank has understood the logic. It say, for example, if you have a lot of gold loan branches, okay, for any 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 bank, that branch is going to build money. That branch is going to be a safe branch. The branch is going to be profitable. But the branch can never make big money for its shareholders, or the branch can never make big money for the company in itself. So CSB Bank now wants to make big money. That's the whole logic here. Okay. Now, how do you make big money? You make big money when you move on from just a being a gold loan brand, a, a bank into say, for example, a retail bank. Okay, kind of things like, for example, that we saw Bajaj Finance in the last ten, twelve, fifteen years, right? Kind of things that we have seen even from the likes of ICICI Bank and HDFC Bank and Kotak Bank. They are because they have been always focused more on the retail lending side, right? And that's why, if you see, right, the I mean, the big multi baggers that we have seen in the financial space, right, are not into the gold loan space. Got it? So, gold loan business is very safe, but if it's very safe. Your yield will also be like more or less compressed. You won't be making big money. So, what is the plan of CSB Bank? So, here is what they are trying to do here. In the next few years, probably in the next five to seven years, का जो plan है उनका, they try to they are trying to diversify away from the gold loan and move more towards retail. So, today retail is around ten fifteen percent of the book. Now, what do I mean by retail? Retail means home loan, loan against property, agri loan. You also have uh, things like. Uh, Uh, I'll tell you one more division, microfinance, right? So these are part of retail, right? So the point is today the book has only around ten to fifteen percent of the book is in retail. CSB Bank is trying to improve the retail percentage of the total book to around thirty percent. So that's the first thing, right? So as I tell you, and of course you will have auto loans as well, commercial vehicle loans as well. But the bank is doing the right things. I'll tell you what they're doing here. They are actually first creating the infrastructure as of today to see CSB Bank. CSB Bank has been hiring a lot of employees, especially at the at the top management. So they are setting up all the pieces so that they can handle this retail base going forward. So 
in in FY23, their employee base grew by 47% on a YOY. And the outlook is that on FY24, the employee base is going to go up at a similar pace, right? And 70 to 80% people at the CXO level, that is CFO, CEO, and on the high level management, people have been hired in the last six months. That means CSB Bank is absolutely serious into, into growing this retail base going forward, right? As I told you, from 15% of the current book to 30% ho jayega. Isse kya hoga? Product mix bhi improve hoga, right? And diversifying away from the gold loan book. So that's the other thing. And 47%, right? If somebody increases employee base at 47% and going forward, we as a rate bold, right? It clearly shows that the bank is bullish. Second is, if you see the management has also talked about putting 70 to 80% of the profits into three avenues, right? One is, of course, employees. Employees may paisa dalna hai. Dusra hai on digitization, like digital. Like, for example, aapka ye jo collection hai. Because CSB Bank has been a traditional South India-based bank all these days. But now they will be digitizing more and more and they will be putting more money into tech. And they have been investing a lot of money in tech. Let me tell you, the management even said, so the cost to income, right? The cost to income of CSB Bank is pretty high at 60%. The management actually says that the cost to income will be around 55 to 60% for the next two, three years as well. Because they are in the mode of investments right now. Capex ki ja rahe. And going from, from 26, 27, FI 27 say, till let's say when it comes to FI 30, the cost to income will come down to 40%. So the management says there is absolutely no chance, absolutely no chance for the bank to reduce its cost to income because they're investing heavily on manpower, they are investing heavily on tech and they are also investing heavily in branches. Now let's come to branches. When we see now, CSB Bank is now trying to move towards retail, right? And you can't be a southern based bank. You can't be a regional bank when you want to be focusing more on retail lending. For retail lending, you need to be a pan-India based uh, organization. So now here is the thing. In FY24, they have guided to they have guided to open around 100, 100 branches. Out of which 60 to 70 branches will be in northern and western part of India. Ab sochi hai, northern and western part of India, mein agar ab dekhoge, wahan pe aapko high quality customers bhi zyada milega. I mean, south mein to hai high quality customers. Lekin north mein aur west mein, I am glad that they are not going to the east. Because I know east mein kya problem hai. As you have seen with Bandhan Bank, right? Assam, Bengal, Bihar. I wouldn't want my lender to be focusing too much on the eastern side, right? But if you're going to the northern and the western side, if you look at, for example, a Kotak Mahindra Bank, Kotak Mahindra Bank only has 6% of its total branches in the east. So CSB Bank is trying to replicate the same thing in the in the retail book. Now, when you go and when you expand, right? So that means what? Those branches will not gold loan branches. Gold loan becomes a part of that branch, but there retail lending going forward. Now, do you see that like, uh, then there was a question asked to the management colleague, when will the retail engine starts? The management says from FY25. Why? Because in the next two years, they will be in the mode of investments. That is what I'm trying to say, right? I mean, see, there will be companies, if the management was not good, they would have, you know, started lending into retail when they don't have the infrastructure ready. But the management is very clear on the fact that our cost to income might remain high, right? But having said that, we will be investing into tech, manpower, and also in branches, right? So that's another way of looking at it. So covered most of the points here. And there is one more point that's very critical here. So CSB Bank knows, like if you look at the bigger banks, right? Bigger banks have bigger presence in the metro and the tier one cities. So CSB Bank has always been a tier two, three, four bank. Because if you look at gold loan, agri loan and all that, right? I mean, gold loans generally up dete ho un logo ko jo bottom strata of the economy mein hota hai, right? For us, semi-urban to rural areas. Mein zyada hote hai. But if you're trying to build a retail base, like auto loan, car loan, right? Uh, housing loan and all that, right? And of course, I understand that when they talk about housing loan, they don't talk about just about affordable housing. Wo bhi segment hoga, but you, you want to also want to give out big ticket housing loan, like what HDFC Limited does. So, us ke se agar ab dekhoge, right? So, CSB Bank, abhi, abhi wo kya kar rahe? Jaise north or west, mein they're targeting the metro cities. Metro tier one ko zyada target kar rahe. Because waha pe, if you look at the structure of any other bank, na, it's like the Pareto principle aap, aapka dimaag mein aani chahiye. The top 20% of the bank contributes to the 80% of sales and profits of a bank. Koi bhi bank ko agar ab dekh lo. So CSB bank now are targeting the, the richer customers going forward, right? I mean, the kind of things that a Bajaj finance has always done. Like consumer finance honi chahiye, but they've always targeted doctors and engineers, right? And the people who are doing well in the economy, rather than, you know, going to going and doing what, let's say, for example, a microfinance business is doing. But it's not bad bhala hai nahi, right? A microfinance business has niche in its area. And of course, a business like a Bajaj Finance will also have a niche in its area. So as an a customer base alag hai, so you say ke like A is poorer than B or B is poorer than A, right? That's generalizing. Matlab aap research nahi kar rahe ho dang se. Okay? So, 
उस तरीके से बात है थोड़ा सा अपडेट का बात करते हैं सीएसबी बैंक ने ये भी बोला कि अगले चार पांच छह साल में सो व्हेन द रिटेल इंजन स्टार्ट्स फ्रॉम एफ आई ट्वेंटी फाइव टू ट्वेंटी सेवन दैट बुक विल ग्रो एट अ वेरी वेरी फास्ट पेस राइट बिकॉज फिफ्टीन परसेंट टू थर्टी परसेंट ऑफ बुक में इट्स इट्स गोइंग टू डू वेल राइट Irrespective of the fact, like the gold loan ka book, which is growing at forty forty one percent. If you if I give you the data right on the Q one update, Q one FY twenty one, which update aaya hai, the gold loan book advances grew forty one percent, and the total book grew thirty percent, right? So that means what gold loan me asa nahi hai ke like they will curtail back on gold loan. But having said that, the focus will be more on the retail bank because they want to make big money now. They don't want to become so CSB bank ke kaisa bank hai na jo itne dead saal wo ek shahar me pada tha, ek region me pada tha. Now they don't want to be a regionalized bank. They want to become a pan India bank. That's why they have spent so much money on employees. They are adding so many employees. Right? And it takes time. Right? Like you, you just can't expect these things to happen like on a month-on-month -month basis. It takes time. That's why the management says that like FY25, we will have to invest in the retail bank. Right? Because retail bank is a business. 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 Right? Because जी स्टेशन पीरियड का मतलब ये होता है कि मतलब ये जो फिनेंशियल है वो अभी अपने आप को प्रिपेयर कर रहा है राइट सो दैट्स अ जी स्टेशन पीरियड सो इन दिस जी स्टेशन पीरियड यू सी द बैंक हैज अ 5000 करोड़ मार्केट कैप व्हिच इज नथिंग राइट इफ यू लुक एट द अदर पैन इंडिया रिटेल लेंडर्स इन दिस कंट्री यू विल से देयर मार्केट कैप ऑफ कोटक देखो एचडीएफसी देखो मैं ये नहीं बोल रहा हूं कि सीएसबी बैंक एचडीएफसी बन जाएगा उस तरह से मैं नहीं आई एम जस्ट हियर सो आई एम नॉट ट्राइंग टू स्पून फीड यू इनटू बाइंग स्टॉक्स दैट इज नॉट द रीजन but my my point of doing all these workshops is to just ensure that you get an idea about how business models work how a bank is thinking what the management is thinking and what the outlook is right so no spoon feeding here so the whole point comes down to this if i give you a final opinion i think i have given about everything okay one more thing is like deposit ka growth be very good hai bank ka 2022% ka so in fy23 the system credit grew at kitna 16% and the system deposit grew at 10% in fy23 over fy22 jabki agar aap csb bank ka dekhoge both in terms of lending as well as in deposit they have almost grown at almost 2x the pace 2x the pace of the 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 system credit which i really like right so as a result of which as a result of which i like the stock okay i might buy the stock if they continue doing well right low market cap hai capex kar raha hai gestation period mein hai and the management is very hungry right i really like the management to be very angry i'll end this video by talking about asset quality the management knows ke like ye sab karne mein agar asset quality of a bank kharab ho jata hai to sab khatam because if you don't get back the existing money you gave out because see lending is a lending is a leverage business right the debt to equity of the of, of all lenders will be around 6x 5x 7x right to agar aapka 10 20% of agar aapka equity gayab ho jata hai to fir aap gaye na matlab sorry 10 20% of agar aapka lending book gayab ho jata hai to your whole equity can go for a toss so ये हमें ट्रैक करना पड़ेगा बिकॉज एक्सपेंशन के चक्कर में तो रिस्क यही है एक्सपेंशन के चक्कर में आप अपना एसेट क्वालिटी ना बिगाड़ो राइट बट देन द बैंक क्लियरली सेट सो द जीएनपी नंबर इज अराउंड 1.2 परसेंट ठीक है अब बैंक क्या बोल रहे हैं कि गोइंग फॉरवर्ड हम अपने जीएनपीए को टू और वन के बीच में रहेंगे और एनपीए को लेस देन वन के आसपास रहेंगे इन द नेक्स्ट फाइव टू सेवन ईयर इस बैंक का एक और चीज है जो मुझे मतलब ऑफकोर्स विथ विथ स्केलेबिलिटी जो अच्छी होनी चाहिए वो है कि कासा रेशियो विच इज प्रेडी वीक राइट तो उसके लिए जो ब्रांचेस खोल रहे हैं ना वो सब लाइबिलिटी ब्रांचेस के लिए भी काम करेगा डिपोजिट उठाएगा तो नॉट ओनली टू मूव फ्रॉम यू नो to uh, not only to move from gold to sme or retail but they are also trying to build the whole liability franchise you saw how v vidyanathan did it with idfc first right and you also saw what uday kotak did with kotak mahindra bank when they got the kasa franchises up to 50 60% of their total deposits that's why idfc first and kotak mahindra bank have been great banks right so idfc ka to aapne dekha hi hoga ke like the whole turn around of this of the business right from roe 2% se abhi roe uh not roe sorry roe uh -huh, roe 2% se abhi it's more than 10 or 12% right and they are targeting 15% so kasa has to be tracked uh the gnp a number has to be tracked so of course asset quality is very very critical but of course everything is good i hope you guys understand ke like why i did this workshop because mera kaam hai aapko opportunities dena hame aapko samjhana ke like what is the management thinking and how are they acting right rather than looking at screener and giving you data points because screener dekhna ka matlab hai piche dekhna got it fy23 mein kya kiya 21 mein kya kiya kya farak padta hai we need to look forward right so 
वही वाला पॉइंट है सी एस बी बैंक इफ यू लुक एट दास्ट यू वोट बी दैट इम्प्रेस्ड बट टूडे एट फाइव थाउजेंड करोड मार्केट कैप यू कैन डेफिनेटली स्टार्ट ट्रैकिंग दिस बिकॉज दिस बैंक इज ट्राइंग टू बिकम बेग अब होगा कि नहीं होगा वो तो हमें एग्जीक्यूशन पर ट्रैक करके देखना पड़ेगा करेक्ट सो वो तो देखना पड़ेगा मैनेजमेंट क्या कर रहा है सो For now, I hope uh, I think I am done. I have covered most of the points. I have taken in my notes. Okay, so if you have any other questions on CSB Bank, please reach out to me. Until then, goodbye.